Greetings patrons, Captain Rick coming to you from Grenada here on the deck of Sophisticated Lady and just wanted to touch base with you guys. I know it's been a while since I sent an actual uh, personal update to you guys so I wanted to sit down and uh, just tell you a little bit what we've been doing. Had a lot going on the last little while and some more projects happening on the boat. We're going to be here in Grenada doing some work for the next little while. And as you can see, just been enjoying a little time on deck sometimes as well. Got the hammock set out. We're in a very nice calm anchorage here. And finally, no weather to deal with. So this is Secret Harbor in Grenada, South Grenada. And this is where we've been for the last couple of weeks while uh, just hiding away from some of the weather and storms or anything like that. And it's been good to us, so really enjoying it here. As you can see, right in against the mangroves. So if anything did come up, we can just quickly tie off and secure the boat right into the mangroves there. And Tiki's sitting here having a good old time, calling all the local birds. Hey Tiki. Hey Tiki. Yeah, good girl. <laughs> hey pretty girl. Yes, one thing you don't know is it's just me on board right now. Everybody's on holiday, including Sasha. She's gone home to visit family and friends in Russia. So I've been here doing some work on some projects and a few surprises for when she comes back. You can see I've got all the wood dug out of our cabin up there again. And it's all taken apart and cut up because we are finally getting stage two underway of the cabin conversion. So we've got all new bedding and everything. And I've got a new queen size mattress showing up today that's going to convert the whole cabin. So that's going to be a great thing. I've been sleeping on that 20 year old mattress for a long time and this last week has just been horrible. I've been actually not even able to uh, get out of bed without being in constant pain lately. So it was time to get on with the conversion. So that's what we're working on right now. And yeah, there's been a couple other major things happen this month that I wanted to fill you in guys because you're the ones that helped make this possible. I mean, we've always got a list of things we're going to be fixing on board and maintaining and repairing, replacing, anything like that. But one of the things that's been coming up on the list for a long time that you probably remember was Sasha's computer because it died back in April, May, something like that with the water damage. And as you can see, that was one of the things I took back to Canada with me and it is now working. So we've got a computer back for Sasha to start editing and working with, so she's gonna be thrilled about that again, I'm sure. The other thing that was of course a major unexpected expense is one of our cameras. We always have to depend on cameras. We need a series of cameras to be able to fall back on if one happens to die or something happens to it, it gets wet, dropped, anything like that. Well. What happened is one of our cameras fell off of the mount, the mount broke off the bottom of the camera and the camera hit the ground and that was it. <laughs> it wasn't very happy after that. So while I was in Canada I had to pick up a new camera and that's this guy here. So we got another Sony AX53, it's my favorite camera of choice and there's good reason for that. If you've never seen one, this is an amazing camera, it actually has stabilization built right into the housing. If you look at this, I think you might be able to see it, but you focus on the lens and you see me moving it around, the lens is floating on a six axis gyro inside the housing. So that's how we managed to get a lot of the stable footage that you guys are always asking about. Of course, I don't talk about that too much in the videos because I like to keep it as my own little secret, but I'm telling you guys, I'll probably end up doing a video review at some point of all our favorite camera gear, including this guy, and the Sennheiser microphones. These things are beautiful little microphone. Compact, small, do a great job. I've compared them to a lot of microphones. They're expensive, it was about $300. I had to buy another one of those when we were in Canada also because we had one that broke. So it's been a bit of an expensive month, but I just wanted to fill you guys in because you're the ones that are helping make this happen. So thanks guys, appreciate the support and the help. We're doing as much as we can in Grenada right now. I've got a lot of projects on the go with uh, local businesses that we are finishing up in the next few weeks. And basically I've got about six weeks to get everything done on the boat before everything's back on, before everybody's back on board. And we are ready to start our next travels. So early November is the target. We're going to start traveling early November and go from there. But that leaves me just enough time to finish up all the projects that I'm working on for some of the companies here in Grenada and hopefully get caught up in some of the travel videos, including the video where Sasha left and everything. But I wanted to keep that a secret because, you know, it's not in the timeline yet. So I didn't want everybody to know Sasha's gone and then 
the next timeline is still going to be our trip up to Martinique. So that's coming up soon. So you guys will get to see it first. So thanks again, guys. Really appreciate it. That was our September update, we'll call it. Look forward to seeing you again next month. And uh, if you're in our $25 category for I Want to Go Sailing, be sure and stay tuned because this week I'm going to pull a name and invite somebody down. So we got lots of places to hang out here. When I'm done my video editing, I'm going to go up into the Grenadines and spend some time. So I'm going to invite one of you guys to come down. And uh, if you're able to come down, we're going to go up and show you some really cool places. So stay tuned for that. Until then, bye for now. Talk to you soon.